look who's with me on my channel. Hi guys! It's Dorothy! <laughs> I'm so I'm, honored. I'm so excited she's here. I'm sure you guys know her channel, but if you don't, you want to go subscribe because she's amazing and Thank you. she has awesome videos. So we're actually doing our first in-person collab together, which is so exciting. We had so much fun filming this. We went ice skating and did a bunch of fun things. So on my channel, we're going to be doing some holiday break ideas and bucket list ideas, fun things to do over winter break and stuff like that. On my channel, I did a winter morning routine and Sophia and I went to coffee shops, did ice skating and a bunch of other things. <laughs> also, we've both been vlogging today. We're doing a behind the scenes of this video. So if you guys want to go see what we've been doing and like the struggles of this video, <laughs> then both of our channels will be linked down below. She seriously has such amazing vlog, oh, guys. You want to check her out. You're doing 12 days of vlogmas, right? I am. And awesome. Dorothy does awesome vlogs too, so you don't want to miss out on those. So I think that's all I have to say for this intro. I really hope you guys enjoy the video, and let's go ahead and get started. One super fun thing you can do this holiday break is make some Christmas cookies. And I actually picked up this kit from Trader Joe's, and it comes with little ugly sweater cookies. Like, how cute is that? But you could easily just make your own cookies from scratch or use other store-bought ones. It doesn't really matter. But Dorothy and I had so much fun making cookies together. We got messy with the icing, and we just had fun talking and laughing. And we also ended up with some pretty delicious cookies, so it's a win-win situation. I think it's just such a fun thing to do if you're bored over the Christmas season. You could even give the cookies you make as gifts. There are just so many things you could do with this. We had such a good time, like I said, and this was definitely something I wanted to do during Christmas break, so I got that checked off my bucket list. Another thing you can do during Christmas time, or really any time of the year, is to give back to the community. This year, I decided to give back by writing a letter to a soldier through amillionthanks.com, and this is not sponsored. I honestly just think this is such a good cause. And I spent a lot of time writing a letter just talking about things I like to do, and also just giving the soldier motivation and thanking them a million times. And I also drew some little pictures on the front to bring the soldier some holiday cheer. And I just couldn't have asked for a better way to do something for others this Christmas. You could also do simple things like paying for a Starbucks order from the person behind you in line or even giving change to the Salvation Army. There are just so many things you can do for others this Christmas and really throughout the year and that just really confirms the true meaning of Christmas to me. So I really recommend doing this and it just makes you feel so good and really get into the Christmas spirit. Too big for the tree. So much shopping, there's no time left for my friends and my family. Another holiday break bucket list idea is to hang out with one of your friends or family members at a coffee shop. Obviously, Dorothy and I went to Starbucks, surprise, surprise, but I got a holiday drink and we just enjoyed sitting in the Starbucks, listening to Christmas music in the background, laughing, catching up, talking. We just had so much fun and I think this is a great way to relax and just kind of enjoy your time off over break and just get into the Christmas spirit even more. It's just so much fun and I really recommend doing this. Another idea for something to do over holiday break is to have a lazy day. And I know it's so easy to get caught up in all of the holiday hustle and bustle, if that makes any sense, and getting all stressed out about getting gifts for people. But I think it's really important to just kind of relax, take a deep breath, and take it easy, especially because you're on holiday break and this only comes once a year. So I made a little corner, cozy corner in my room. I lit some Christmassy candles to make my room smell super holiday-like. And I also set out my favorite pillows and blankets you could just sit on your bed if you don't feel like doing this but I thought this was a fun step and I just put on one of my favorite Christmas movies which is the Santa Claus drink some hot cocoa and it's just so much fun to relax and take some time to be with yourself and just kind of catch up on some much needed rest this is definitely one of my favorite things to do over holiday break <laughs> It's the most A super fun thing to do over holiday break is to go ice skating. So Dorothy and I went to an outdoor ice skating rink where we live and it was so pretty outside. The weather was beautiful. There were Christmas trees and Christmas music playing everywhere and everyone just seemed in the holiday spirit. Also, I don't know about you guys, but whenever it's Christmas time, I love it to be cold outside. And if you live somewhere warmer, if you just find an ice skating rink, it'll instantly feel cold around you because obviously you're on the ice. But even though Dorothy and I are not the best skaters, we were kind of stumbling. We 
still had such a good time. We made some good memories and you can also take some Instagram pictures or just kind of enjoy, live in the moment and just have fun. I know I'm sounding so cheesy right now, but it's true. I definitely recommend going ice skating. You can get some vitamin D outside and just make some good memories with your friends or family. Right, so that is it for today's video. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Please make sure to give it a big thumbs up and subscribe down below for more videos. And this is my last video posted until Christmas. So I hope you all have a wonderful Christmas. I love you so much. And I will um, see you guys for my what I got for Christmas video just like any other girl on YouTube. <laughs> make sure to go check out Dorothy's video and channel as well. And yeah, I think that's all I have to say. So thank you guys again for watching. I love you so much and I'll talk to you in my next video. Bye!